What's up guys, it's Tom here from Code, author, educator and public speaker. I'm here to give you three reasons why Holland is a great place to visit. Yes, Holland, the Netherlands. Whichever name you want to know for the country, it's a really great place to visit. I had the pleasure of visiting back in 2016, around this time. I remember it quite well, obviously the football was on. The uh, European Championships, Euro 2016 as it was, England were playing, but I wasn't really too bothered about that. I was there to sample and sort of soak in the vibe of Amsterdam. It was a three-day city break and it was very, very good. I really enjoyed myself. And three days, believe it, as you probably would know, is absolutely plenty of time for a city break, three, four days maximum really. You don't really want to be doing any more than that. So, what were my reasons for loving the place so much? Well, number one, it's a very cultural place. When I say cultural, I mean in terms of the history, the art. This place is an absolute epicenter for what you probably call a rich vein of old, and contemporary artwork. It's a lot of very fine buildings, a lot of quaint and different things going on there. Uh, you've got lots of museums with some fine, fine pieces of art, obviously. The Van Gogh Museum. I say Van Gogh because that's how they pronounce it. Uh, we call him Van Gogh. And it's a really, really interesting place, really, really quaint place, and definitely a place that you should visit. Uh, if you get the opportunity, definitely grab it with both hands. I did, and I'll happily go again at some point. Reasons number two would be the people. Like any place, it has its own sort of vibe, and the people are, to you and me, they'd be classed as a bit crazy, but they're really welcoming, they're really, really friendly, they're really top people, to be honest with you. I remember back in primary school, my head teacher for a time was a Dutch woman. And this place, as a country, is always in the top ten of best places to grow up. They're very fami family orientated people, and they're very respectful and fun and quirky and great to be around. And they make you feel very welcome in their country. So, you know, what more could you want? Their attitudes are very different to what ours are in terms of how they view things in terms of what they do, what they accept to be okay, obviously. You walk down the street in Holland, in Amsterdam, the cafes smell of marijuana, because they are totally fine with that. Uh, not for me myself, but for some of you, if that's what you're into, you can do that and have no question there of the law because it is, it is legal. So you're quite open-minded in some respects. And then, of course, you know, you've got certain areas of Amsterdam that are well known. And you know where I'm referring to with this. Yes, the red light district. If you are going to go to Amsterdam, make sure you take a map with you. And the area is called De Warren. Careful. That's all I've got to say. If you're walking around there at a particular time of day and the rain has come. Uh, let's just say the women are quite about getting business. That's all I'm going to say to that. <laughs> and then the third and final thing is you've got the culture, you've got the lifestyle and definitely it's got its own vibe. The whole place has got its own vibe. You've got a real mixture there of modern and contemporary. You've got something for everyone, I think. And not just in terms of what they've got to offer in terms of sites. If you're not wanting to spend thousands of pounds, because city breaks can be expensive, you've got a range there of things in place to have a cheaper holiday if you want, obviously. Your budget's only so much, you want to only spend X, Y, Z on accommodation. You can get a hostel, or you can get a cheaper hotel, it's entirely up to you, obviously. With that, you will 
be putting yourself into the old region of what you're getting, what you pay for. But equally, they are totally fine, totally clean, and you will still have a good time because you can make it a good time. And I believe that anyone can make anything good of it with the right mindset. You can make your holiday good or bad, no matter how much money you spend. I personally, myself, when I was out there, there is the option to go out into the countryside and see the old style Holland, you know, like the old sort of way of living. That would be like the windmills and the countryside. And that really appeals to me too. And one final point as well about the vibe. And you will laugh because most cities throughout the world, you're watching yourself for cars, buzzies, busy traffic. In Holland, in Amsterdam, watch out for the bikes. And when I say watch out for the bikes, I mean it because honestly, they do not have brakes. Don't let that put you off though. They can stop, but they have to backpedal. And the speed that they go at, wow. You'll be dodging in and out of them. But literally after about a day, you get used to it. So yeah, those are my three reasons for why I think Holland is a really good holiday destination. I'm dedicated now to making three videos a week about various things lifestyle well-being travel please make sure you hit the like button down below and the notifications bell and also hit that subscribe and i'll see you guys again soon thank you